Well, there are some happenings this April at First Baptist. Hope you can join us for morning worship as we follow after Jesus. We shared during Lent leading up to Easter that before Jesus, life has a lot of difficulties and a lot of challenges. After Jesus, even though it can still be challenging, there's a great joy that we experience in his salvation. We want to encourage you to be part of that with worship, but also in April we have our share groups. So it's uh, true to Jesus's uh, own display after the resurrection. He shared meals with his disciples as one of the pieces of evidence of uh, his, his resurrection, and then also our calling to do that together. Both one, to remember uh, his death and sacrifice, what we often celebrate as communion, uh, but then also to share together. Uh, shared meal is a great equalizer. It brings people to the table, uh, various uh, educations, walks of life, um, but we all need to eat. So hopefully you can join us this Sunday as we kick off our shared groups. I also encourage you, uh, Wednesday nights, we have some wonderful Bible studies. We have a friendship class that meets before worship, uh, 9.15 a.m. on Sunday mornings. Um, and if you're around the Hillsborough area, you can join us for worship at 9 a.m. at First Baptist Church in Hillsborough as well. So some of those events coming up, uh, Family Life Ministries on Wednesday nights has this last quarter, the next five weeks. Um, and there's some real good Bible study uh, for the adults and certainly for the kids alike. Uh, lastly, as you get towards the end of April, we'll be leading into May for Mother's Day, some graduate recognition. Uh, we've had a lot of babies born, so if you're looking to uh, celebrate uh, in addition to your family, look for the signups for the baby dedications, very special uh, service on May 8th. Uh, otherwise, I want to leave you with this. The Lord has great plans for all of us. You are not excluded from that. Allow yourself the opportunity to be a part of his fellowship both with the worshiping church and with the shared meal. I hope that shared meal is not just on Sundays with our ministries, but spend some time this week, uh, especially in the spring. And try to find some time when your family can gather around and sit down together, catch up. If you know of anybody who eats alone, may you do so much as to stop by, make a phone call, include them, invite them in. Um, one of the best ways to serve Jesus is to welcome others. And a very easy way is everybody loves to eat. Amen.